which I currently have nothing in my hair. I'm gonna hold it here at the end for one, two, three. Wow. I'm blown away. I am completely and utterly blown away. What's going on beautiful people? I'm Charlene Madeline and welcome to my channel. If you are just tuning in for the first time, it is a pleasure to have you. You are in for a treat for today's video. Today's video is sponsored by Timo right here. And I am so excited to get into this bad boy. Timo sent me their Ring Plus hair straightener. I cannot wait to try this. This has been on my wish list for quite a while now to try out. I've been a little bit hesitant. I was like, I'm can I do this? Can I do this? And, and I'm going to face my fears today. So not only did they send me the Ring Plus straightener, they also sent me the heat protectant mist included in the box. It also has the carrying pouch as well as two clips, a heat protectant glove, and a little brush to brush my hair out as I am combing through each section. All right, guys, it is time. Let us start. So I have nothing in my hair as I specified. I I can't even recall the last time that I didn't put any product in my hair whatsoever. So I'm expecting my hair to be a little bit knotted um, on the bottom just because my hair is on the finer end and it does get knotted very, very quickly. So I'm like very, very hesitant. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and divide this. I'm going to put this in a claw clip. Now there is, there are a couple of ways that I could have done this. I could have braided my hair in a couple of sections, have my hair air dry in that way, so that way it's just, and I can go into each section. I'm kind of doing this this way for dramatic effect. I wanted to see if I didn't do it in a convenient way, how my hair would actually turn out. So let us find out. Okay, so we have here the power button. I've already plugged it in. I'm gonna turn it on and so it says to turn it to 400 degrees Fahrenheit for thick, curly, and wavy hair. So let's do that, 400. All right, so it says that it takes about 60 seconds to get hot. So now we wait. <laughs> All right, while that is heating up, I am going to divide my hair into the two pieces. I'm probably gonna do this into four pieces. I'm gonna use the brush that they gave me and I'm just going to brush out my curls. All right, so for this, I am gonna use a little bit of the heat protectant mist on it. I just, I'm, I've am i always used heat protectant in my hair whenever I'm blow drying it, and this is a hair straightener, so in my mind, this would actually be more intense than a blow dryer. So we're gonna just spritz this on here. is really nice and it smells really good <laughs> all right so the temperature has stopped blinking right here it was blinking before when i was trying to put it on the actual uh temperature so let's go ahead and divide this into two pieces because i'm not sure how thick i am able to do the pieces yet so we're gonna go ahead and put that up and I hear it. I wonder if you guys can hear this. It's like, it's almost like tingling. All right. It does feel warm to the touch here. So I bet this thing is hot as hell. Okay. So now it says to start from the root and I'm just gonna comb, oh wow, down. I'm gonna go a little bit slower, just as I would in a using a flat iron. All right, that's one pass. It says to do it in about three to four passes, so I'm gonna do maybe two. I'll do three. I'm gonna go ahead again, go a little bit slower. I wanna make sure I take my time because I don't wanna rush this and have to go over a ton of times. Dang. What in the world? This is amazing. Okay. My ends, guys, don't 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 come at me. My ends, I recently cut my hair and I used a new hairstylist and she cut my ends a little wonky. 
as you can see. So don't come at me. It looks good with my hair curly, but straight, it's gonna look, it's gonna look a little cray cray. All right, let's go through one more time. I'm just gonna go through one more time just to, I'm gonna go a little bit faster and I'm gonna try curling it. I'm gonna see if I'm able to, yes. Oh my God, this is amazing. Okay, all right, next section. This is insane, all right. Okay, going through. That little steam there, I'm guessing that's the oil from the heat protectant. I'm adding a little bit of tension here because I think my hair always looks a little better whenever I add a little bit of tension, whether that's blow drying, flat ironing. Guys, what? I'm just gonna first do this like this. No tension this time. I'm gonna hold it here at the end for one, two, three, go through. Wow. Wow. Wow, I am like blown away. This is, oh my God. <laughs> okay, next section. <laughs> this is gonna be like a 10 minute video. This is insane. Okay, okay. We're, I'm gonna get through this section and then I'm gonna give you my thoughts. And then we're gonna just keep, we're gonna just keep, keep it moving. We're gonna just keep it moving. Keep moving, I keep, keep moving. I really liked how my hair felt with the heat protectant mist, so we're gonna do that again. This is a bigger section than I did before. Okay. Dun, 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 dun. Moment of truth. Okay, so first pass. It didn't get the front section. So we're gonna just go through the other side. This is insane, guys. My hair is so soft. Oh my god. Okay. It's because I want a little bit of something at the end, you know? The girl always needs to, always needs to do something a little a little fancy at the end. It's a little flipperoo. Kind of botch that section a little bit. I was trying to get out of it and they couldn't. Okay. Let's see. Nope, nope. Okay. Let's try to Ladies! This is amazing. Hell yeah. God. All right. First impression. I feel like you kind of know my first impression. I've been giving it to you this entire time. Oh my God, yes, what? Holy crap. Okay, so first impression, my hair feels amazing. It feels so soft. I can run my fingers through it. This, this argon oil infused, this thing is helping my hair, I think, so much getting, gaining the benefits of using the straightener. There's no tension when it comes to this. So that's the reason why I'm, I'm having to add the tension. I think if I didn't use the tension, I would have to use it multiple times. I'm trying to avoid that as much as I can, right? Only going through like two times, but the two times are worth it. This is, this is doing its thing. It's steaming right now. Like <laughs> you guys can't see it in the camera, but here it's, it's steaming. I'm wondering if that's from the argon oil. So my hair is still in there, so I wonder if that's what's steaming. All right, we, we, I, I'm going to try to get through most of my hair and then I'll come back with some comments if I have any. Um, or you might hear the occasional, oh my gosh, in between this. This took me like five minutes. Oh my gosh. What in the world?
All right guys, so I've been recording for about 26 minutes now and I just wanna show you how much hair that I have done. This has been extremely easy for me to use. Like, this is my first time ever opening the product, using the product ever and I'm blown away from how easy it is. Like, all I kept thinking was, why didn't this product exist when I was a teenager? My hair is so shiny. Yes, my haircut is a little botched. That's the only thing. The ends of my hair is a little bit like, okay. For the first try ever, right? And doing it in a way that was not the most convenient in the sense that I just let my hair air dry and just do its thing instead of putting it in braids. <sighs> like, I can't even, this is, wow. Okay, so let me finish up my hair and then I'll give you guys my final thoughts. Look at this, guys. Okay, Pocahontas hair, like, ugh. Oh. That's amazing. Okay. I'm gonna brush it out a little bit again. Oh my gosh. Oh my Oh my gosh, it's so soft. I cannot. Okay. And I'm just gonna get into the root right here. Last two sections, guys. This has been this has been such a breeze. Like way more breezy than I thought it was gonna be. And I'm done. Okay, thanks guys, bye. No, I'm just kidding. All right, so let's, I mean, I am done. So let's see what the final result looks like. Okay, this is the final result. Right here, I'm gonna flash it around so that way I'm not stagnant so you can see what it looks like in some movement, with some movement. First, what do you guys think? Because I'm gonna let you know what I think right now. I'm blown away. I am completely and utterly blown away by this straightener. Growing up, I used to fly iron my hair all the time. And it was kind of the way, it was an easier way for me to straighten my hair instead of going through the whole process of like, blow drying it because I could never get a good blowout whenever I would blow dry my hair. I would go straight to flat ironing it and it just wouldn't turn out how I wanted it to even when I would flat iron it. Like, okay, it would be super greasy or my hair would be super dry or et cetera, et cetera. And I said this earlier, but I'm gonna say it again. I wish I had a product like this when I was a teenager. It would have helped me so much, right? And I used it with my hair big and air dried out big. Like I could have easily made my life a little bit easier if I had just braided my hair in sections, washed my hair the night before, put my hair in sections, sleep with it wet or whatever, you know, and have it air dry out throughout the day, throughout the night, whatever you wanna do, right? And in the morning, just take out those sections and then use this and just brush through those sections and your hair would be so straight. Using this for the first time, I mean, it was so easy. My hair, as you can see, like I can't even, I'm blown away by the results. My hair is so soft right now. It's shiny, it's silky. Sure, I have a little bit of dry areas somewhere because it's my first time using it and I still need to familiarize myself with not only using the product, but having the technique down a little bit easier so that way I get the best benefits of using this by using this um, comb straightener. Some tips I would say using this product, again, maybe braiding your hair into sections so that way it's just a little bit easier to handle. 
um, adding some tension to your hair as you are straightening it. I noticed that as I held onto my hair, if I just like brush through it, yeah, I can brush through it, but you see how the hair kind of like falls right out? And then I feel like I need to go over it a couple times and it can be kind of frustrating. So what I do is literally holding it here, applying it, and then you see how it's like all the way through, and then just holding this hair and adding some extra tension to your hair as if you are blow drying it. That to me works like the best. It heats up extremely fast, so fast. I actually didn't even need to use the glove. Um, I've used gloves in the past and the stickiness, whenever I try to use it to my hair, it ends up just hurting me because your girl's got a sensitive scalp. So I'd rather not go that route. Also, let's talk about the Argon heat protectant. I think that if I didn't have this, my hair would have turned out way different, probably a little frizzier. So I would say that this is a must. I, it really helped me and my hair feels really soft. Overall, this product to me gets like a 9.8 out of 10. With that being said, I think this wraps up this video. I am, I am, I am so happy with how my hair turned out, especially for my first time ever using this product. If you guys are interested, I'll leave links for you guys in the description. And uh, thank you, Timo, for sending me this, your ring plus straightening comb. It did its thing. Your girl's happy. <laughs> All right, guys, with that being said, let me know what you guys think. Leave a like, some comments, and subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys with the next video. See ya.